You are looking live now at the Blue Spring State Park Manatee Camp, and we have some great news coming out of there today. Manatees are continuing to make a comeback. Isn't that pretty to see? I love that place. I know. Florida Today reporting spotters counted more than 6,200 manatees in Florida this winter. That's almost 200 more than last year. Now, sometime this year, federal wildlife officials plan to reclassify manatees from endangered to the less serious status of threatened. They say manatees no longer are in danger of extinction. But that is such That's great fantastic news. news. Yeah. And it's nice to see more and more packing into Blue Spring each yeah. year. Speaking of Blue Spring State Park, News 6 meteorologist Candace Campos is there. Yeah, she is pinpointing your weather in Orange City tonight. All right, we've made it to our next spot here out in Orange City. And of course, where else would we be but the beautiful Blue Spring State Park trying to find some manatees out there. It's been pretty warm over the last couple of days as temperatures were even in the 80s, if you remember, last week and even into this week. And because of that, most manatees started heading out. But now that the cold snap just started, do expect some more manatees to start making their way in. At last check today, I spotted about five, maybe up to seven, a few babies even out there. So if you are planning on heading out here to Blue Spring Park. Do expect a few more manatees, especially as we head into the weekend. So back out here, the reason we are going to see more manatees is because the temperatures are going to stay a bit on the cool side. So let's pinpoint your weather forecast right down here in Orange City. For tonight, it will continue to stay breezy like it has been today. Temperatures will be dipping into the upper 40s, nice clear skies, but then just picture perfect conditions for tomorrow. If you don't mind those cooler temperatures as we will be warming up only into the mid 60s. Our next stop coming up at 6 o'clock is going to be out in the land. But for now, at Orange City, I'm News 6 meteorologist Candace Campos.